Number six, predict whether each of the following substances would be more soluble in water, which is a polar solvent, or in a hydrocarbon such as heptane, which is C7H16, a nonpolar solvent. And then we have the molecule in question, isopropyl alcohol, and they tell us that isopropyl alcohol is polar. Now, isopropyl alcohol, just to put this into consideration, is rubbing alcohol, right? The alcohol that we use if maybe we have a cut or something. I think, I think you put that on cuts. <laughs> um, but that's basically the alcohol that we're talking about. Now, would this want to dissolve? That's what solubility means, or to be soluble. If something is soluble, it's going to dissolve in a certain solvent. And if you dissolve, you won't be able to see where it is anymore because it makes a homogeneous mixture with the solvent. Now, there's a very famous saying in chemistry that like dissolves in like. Like substances want to be around their own kind, meaning that if you have a polar sol solute, right, it's going to want to dissolve in a polar solvent. So polar goes with polar. And if you have a nonpolar solute, you would want to dissolve it in a nonpolar solvent. This is due to the similarities in their intermolecular forces. So they did tell us that isopropyl alcohol is polar. So if I want to dissolve a polar solute, I need it to be dissolved in a polar solvent. So I'm looking for the one that's polar between water and heptane. They said that water was polar. So in this case, polar goes with polar. So uh, this would be water or H2O, but I'll, I guess I'll just say water. What kind of W is that? <laughs> there we go. And that's it. How quick and easy was that? Do, 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 let's box it off and call it a video. So just always remember this saying, like dissolves in like, and that's it. I hope this helped. Thank you for viewing the video. Subscribe to the channel if you want to help us out. Um, tell your friends, tell your classmates about this channel. Just gets the word out there that this channel exists. Thank you so much. And I hope to be talking to you in future lessons or maybe past lessons, maybe ones I did already. But either way, I'm with you every step of the way. I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.